Welcome to Genshin Optimizer, where we carefully consider all feature requests for far too long. In this guide, I'll show you the brand new, highly requested, multi-target optimization feature. I'm sure you've all come across a situation where you want the best overall for your character, but choosing to optimize normal, skill or burst talents give totally different results and you struggle to find a good balance of them all. I'm looking at you, Tartalia Mains. Well now there's an answer for you. Custom multi-target optimization accessible from the custom multi-target config button at the top of every character page. If you've watched our advanced optimization techniques video, you'll remember the workaround for determining how much elemental mastery to use on Vape Yoimiya. Well now let's redo this example using the new multi-target feature. This current Yoimiya build is forcing a minimum of 100 elemental mastery while optimizing for the non-vaped fifth hit. First of all, remove the minimum constraint and then open the multi-target configuration pop-up. Now click Add New Custom Multi-Target, give it a name, and click Add New Custom Target. This will bring up a list of all damage targets available to use. This is where you really need to understand the character and how to play them in certain situations. You can easily create a bad or impossible combination which will lead to a poor optimization result. Remember, the optimizer is just a calculator. If you feed it bad data, you'll get a bad answer. In the case of Vapeoimia, her ICD only allows for every third hit to trigger a vaporized reaction, but because her first and fourth arrows actually hit twice, you end up triggering the vaporize on the first, third and fifth hits. If for some reason you are playing in a ride and overload team, you could also add some instances of overloaded damage, and then include the elemental burst damage bonus from ride and skill by adding additional stats to just these targets remembering to take into account how many normal attacks you would do per burst. Once you're happy with the rotation, you can close this window, go to the optimization target pop-up, and select the custom multi-target you just made. The generation time will be noticeably longer now, but when it's complete, you'll have the best combined total damage for your custom target rotation. However, one important thing to note is you cannot use multi-target to optimize for different types of values, such as damage combined with shield strength or healing. While the system will allow you to, the result will not be mathematically sound as the optimizer is simply outputting the biggest single number, and so does not know the comparative value of a 10k shield versus 10k of damage. Due to this complexity and the vast customization of multi-target optimization, we can't really go through more examples as there is many nuance in playstyle, teammates, and weapons that you must take into consideration for your own account and situation. We recommend you read some guides, or experiment in-game to discover how the character you are optimizing for actually works in the situation you want. I hope this guide was helpful, and if you have further questions, don't hesitate to join our Discord community to ask for assistance.